744 and welcome back. High School Musicals taking center stage at the Belk Theater tonight at the 10th Annual Bloomy Awards. The event will feature students, teachers, and alumni. One of those alumni, Thomas Laub, Providence Day School grad and two-time Tony Award producer. Thomas, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. It's a pleasure to be home. Well, let's talk about it. You're back, but you're based in New York and you've won two Tonys right now as a producer. That's a big deal. And you got Gutenberg the musical going on right now. Yes, so much fun. I mean, we've been so lucky to be involved with so many really exciting shows from so many wonderful, wonderful artists. And I think Gutenberg is is testament to that. Josh and Andrew, so absolutely incredible. And it's been so much fun with that show and to see the journey over the past couple months. Well, we just talked about it. You're a grad from Providence Day, but you are also 2015 Bloomy Award nominee. Look at that. You, you'd love that. Please, right? guys. A two-time Bloomy Award loser. It, it, it comes with the territory. Yeah, but you, you're on the stage, and this is such a great thing for local high school actors. Um, just talk about how important it is to have these awards for the high school actors and what the Bloomy Awards do. It means everything, and it's so much of the reason why I was so excited to come back and support the Blumenthal and Tom Gabbard's efforts to continue to grow the Bloomy program. The Bloomy program gave me everything. It really gave me a community. It gave me a community of like-minded folks who all had aligned goals going into the industry. And as we all moved to New York, I, th I like to say that the Bloomy gave me, the Bloomies gave me the most hilarious problem, which is I now can't get through my day in New York without seeing other people who came through the Bloomy Awards. Um, and it's just such a testament to what they do. I think, you know, we, we have a long running joke at the Broadway League that where, um, where, we, where we say, what's in the water in Charlotte? And I think it's just, again, such a, such a testament to the incredible work that the education department at the Blumenthal does to get these students ready for a career in the arts and a sustainable career in the arts. And that's one of the great things because there are so many alumni. So you guys do run into each other. And I know The Wiz was here a few months ago and you're a producer of that one too. So, and there was, there is another Bloomy uh, nominee in that one as well. Absolutely, Phil. Phil Johnson Richardson is absolutely stunning in The Wiz and wowed Charlotte audiences and audiences across the country before we come to New York this spring. So we're so excited to have him and I think, again, it's, it's actually impossible to have a show without Bloomy nominees and Bloomy participants at this point. So it, it really just shows how incredible the talent base is at Charlotte and also how incredibly developed it is from all the wonderful education programs, both from local teachers and arts educators and the Blumenthal itself, Charlotte Children's Theater as well. So it's, it's really important that as we move into the next 10 years of the Bloomy Awards, that we, we start to expand the access to the Bloomy Awards, which is what the new Inspire Fund is all about and why I'm so excited to be home. I was going to say, yeah, that Inspire, that Inspire Fund is going on, but you also came back because you're the host. So <laughs> Guilty as charged. Guilty as charged. It's going to be a fun night. I think we have a couple surprises in store. We have some, uh, we have some fun times with my, my co-host Brigida and I tonight, and it's going to be a really good night at the Belk. I was going to ask, you know, and we have asked, are you going to be belting out any tunes? Are you going to be doing I, anything there? You know, I guess you'll just have to come see. I guess you'll have to. Tickets are available now. So I think uh, if you come see, you might have a couple surprises in store. We have yeah. some good stuff cooking up. And that's so great. So thank you so much for coming back. And is there anything else you want to add just about being home or what's coming up for you that coming up next? Absolutely. I think, you know, we've been so lucky enough to produce both in the television and film space and the Broadway space. But really what we're excited about is the opportunities like this to come back and give more opportunity to the places that gave everything to us. And so the Bloomy Awards and Tom Gabbard and the Blumenthal have done so much for us and have kind of put us in position to be here. So the more that we can come back and support these incredible programs, the better. So we're excited for all to come. That sounds great. And that's right. So many more great local high school actors that will be coming to New York and spreading their wings and everything else. Thank you so much for joining us. Two-time award-winning producer, Thomas Loud.